This video we're covering the setup of the Galaxy 5 watch. This is a Galaxy 5 Pro. Um, so we'll go through the setup process for you today. Uh, let's get stuck into it. So the first thing we need to do is install the Wear OS software for uh, Samsung. This is an Android phone of course, and we'll do a search for uh, Galaxy wearable. You'll get this uh, icon turn up here, the blue square one. You'll know you have the right one there. You'll need to do the install there. Okay, once it's installed, just click on open. Okay, uh, so connect, so we need to connect to the watch. So you go through the start process, it does a scanning, it'll do for a Bluetooth connection. You can see it's found it straight away. Galaxy Watch 5 Pro. Now setting up this connection will also assist with uh, um, uh, setting up with languages as well. So it'll look for the language set up in your device and configure it as well. Hopefully that works, that's what it's supposed to do. So we're looking for a pair here. So we've got a pair there, so we allow access and we'll do a pair. And you can see straight away, uh, the Asian language there, probably Chinese, um, has now changed to English. And that's because it's connected to the phone and which is in English. And so uh, we've made that connection. Um, now it's looking for permissions uh, to a whole raft of uh, uh, device um, functions on your phone, phone contact, SMS, calendar, call logs. Uh, you're pretty much going to need everything for this thing to be useful. So just continue. Um, allow Galaxy Wearable to manage your watch and allow. Okay, uh, so uh, sign in for more features. So we've got uh, Samsung Health there, Backup and Restore, Bixby and Watch. So we can uh, skip this uh, if you wish. You can do that later. There's a skip button there. Okay, so uh, you can send diagnostic data um, and agree to automatic updates. I'm going to just leave it to the default. You can toggle that if you wish. I'm just going to agree to automatic updates and continue. Uh, allow the Galaxy Watch 5 to manage your device. Allow. Terms of agreement. Uh, um, you can leave these on or off. I'm going to decline the uh, diagnostic reports. May use location is fine for me. Automatic updates and agree. Now it's installing the software and configuring it. Okay. Now it's going to look for a Google account information to sign in. It's going to take a while so we Okay, so sign into your Google account and just select your account. It's asking me to thumbprint identification.
Okay, so this is your opportunity to select the apps for your watch. Uh, okay, so installed apps here. We've got Spotify, Google Camera. We've got some other ones. Uh, so I'm gonna, um, okay with all of those. Uh, we might take the coded room off for now. Um, and there's some other recommended uh, applications that it can install for you. Um, so you've got some sound software there, some deep sleep medication, uh, and this could vary depending on what part of the world you are. E easy voice recorder, uh, calorie counter, you know, workout programs, there's a whole bunch of stuff there. Uh, you can choose to continue and select all those or the ones you want. I'm just gonna go with a few there, so continue. You can always add them later, it's no big deal. Okay, watch has just come up then. All right, we've got a connection showing the battery power on the on your watch. Now there's a lot you can do here, and I'm not going to go through all the options, but you can change the watch faces and change all the application screen options, um, and there's a lot there, right? So I'm not going to go through all of that uh, in this video. So what we'll do now, we'll start the tutorial on your, let's we'll put that to the side for a minute. We'll start the tutorial for your watch that you need to go through. Won't let you continue unless you go through this tutorial. Okay, swap down from the top to open the quick panel. So it's just going through, trying to instruct you uh, all the options or some of the basic functions here. Swiping up, swiping left and right is something you're gonna to have to get quite familiar with, with using the watch. Tap to open notifications. Swipe right, tap to open notifications. Swipe left. Tiles to the left. Early activity. And this is your home key here. So this is important. So this is your home key up here. It'll always take you home. Uh, right, and don't miss a thing. The orange dot is the indicator. So if you're in a, if you're in a activity, like um, measuring body uh, composition, for instance, and you wanna go back one screen, that's the, that's the bottom right hand key. And if you want to go home, here's the home button up the top there. And that's it. Okay, so now you're connected um, and you can play to your heart's content. Thanks for watching. Catch you next time. See you guys.